Thanks for tuning in to Let's Talk About It Media 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And please turn on the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you'll be the first one to see it. Let's get into it. What we're going to talk about, we talk about celebrity news, celebrity gossip, what's going on on IG and Google. Fair use. Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976. Allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comma, comments, comma, news reporting, comma, teaching, comma, scholarships, and research. Fair use is use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. All comments are alleged in our opinion and for entertainment purposes only. And don't forget, the Cash App is Let's Talk About It Media. And thank you for your love and support. So don't forget to like, to comment, and also subscribe, and also turn on the notification bell. So let's get into what's being reported. I'm going to just be general, quick hot topics. It's being said that campaign um, and chaos. Kanye West just wants to be left alone. We get it. Like I said, there's some people that literally try to talk about Kanye on a daily basis. Two or three videos, and he has not done one interview. He has posted only two times over the last two or three times over the last three or four months, people make it seem like they know what he's thinking. It's weird. So I don't blame him for saying, leave me alone. We also get that he is, and he has made his statements in regards to his children, not wanting North on TikTok. Basically, you know, what he felt about that, pretty much a lot of people helped him in regards to posting that. So if you want to go on to the Daily Blast, go into, they'll go over more of what's being said, but he basically wants to be left alone. He doesn't want to be a part of the K's and the J's storyline. He doesn't want to be talked about. He doesn't want to be gaslit. He doesn't want to be talked about from Pete. He doesn't want to be talked about from Kim. He doesn't even want to make it seem like they're speaking about him, talking about him, you know, just leave him alone. And that's the biggest thing. The K's and the J's love talking about men. In regards to good relationship, bad relationship, shaved me, called me, text me. And then remember how um, someone had posted how Kim's always trying to do plot, plan, twist, media manipulation. She had had her phone out and people were so weird and like, okay, who who is that a message from? She did it on purpose to have her phone out. Um, does the first name start with a K? Was Kanye texting her? Even if he was, that's the mother of his children. They have to communicate. People are getting weirder and weirder and weirder. The, the Kardashians love to do zingers, fix a filter of a picture, trip and fall. My hair is messed up. I over filter this picture. My lips are poked out. They love doing stuff to have people talk about them. And this is the biggest thing. They love when people have large audience, they love planting stories and people are doing those stories. Good, bad, ugly, or different. It's keeping them in the media. And if it's a regards to a product, the K's and the J's love that. So let's get to the next thing because it's basically saying that Kim Kardashian is basically seeking and wants, is, is ready to mingle. Ready to mingle. Kim Kardashian is more open to dating again and putting herself out there. Now, mind you, this is the third time she said it. <laughs> so maybe men aren't trying to react because they've seen what she said to Kanye. They've seen how she treated Kanye. They, they've heard me say many times she didn't think that they were going to work and she wanted his time to have more children. She wanted his help. They've seen how she talked about Pete's BBE. They may be concerned about the NDAs. They may be concerned about all these alleged lawsuits. They may be concerned about becoming a storyline. 
you could be dating someone else. You could be have you could have moved on and they're going to use you maybe constantly. It's almost kind of like Kanye's if you don't even notice it, Kanye's probably being talked about by the K's or the J's or referencing him at least twice a month. If you don't notice it, you won't notice it. If you don't see it, you don't see it. And then here it is in regards to Courtney's wedding stuff. And I've seen posts about Kim gave advice. It should be about Courtney. North was like, uh, because they're kissing. But if that was her mom kissing somebody, then it would be an okay thing. Kim wants to inundate every story. It's kind of weird. And people keep asking, is she okay? Now, I just did a video in regards to possibly TikTok is being banned in Montana. If you realize, Kanye's not going to sit back and not stand up for his daughter. There's comments, there's concerns, there's this, that. Why isn't Kim protecting the daughter? My body, soul, and spirit is concerning. So you think guys aren't seeing that? Guys would have to take on her and the four children. But then they really can't meet the alleged four children to six months later. Guys saw how she did Pete, period. <laughs> Pete got dragged. Pete got dragged about his jokes. Pete got dragged about being on uh, North being on his lap. Pete got Pete was felt the need to tell Kanye, "I'm in bed with your wife." You know what I'm saying? So people saw how that all went. Even though Kanye's in a happy relationship, he seems at peace. Kanye's not paying no attention to nobody. Real talk. Now, mind you, I've talked about this before. Kanye goes in spurts. Well, he'll communicate. He'll be quiet for three, four months, maybe. And then he'll say something maybe for a month or two. But he has these waves to where he just doesn't want to be bothered. Now, mind you, in the video from TMZ, the lady said she really doesn't blame Kanye all that much. You got to go check the video out. So why is she suing him? And like I said, there's guidelines that they have to follow in regards to a school district. Anybody can go to the board and say, this is a problem. That's a problem. So versus her, did she go to the school board and complain? Did she go to the school district and complain? But we've seen pictures in regards to the children being in chairs. Now, also in regards to whether they eat sushi, some people are, if the kid is allergic to shell, shellfish or sushi, can they bring in something else? So who, who knows? But it's a good thing he's not really even paying attention to all the drama, the press. He's ignoring it all. He don't even want to be a part of the K's and the J's. Now, mind you, the K's and the J's made it very clear that Kanye, Scott, and Travis Scott wasn't a part of the buckets. Who cares? Kanye was probably chilling with his girl, having a good time. They don't care about no buckets, but I posted it. I talked about it because the K's and the J's want to keep him in the stories. They're planting stories so they can stay trending, stay in the media. Now, mind you, I get as a dad, he should be concerned with the mother's doing, with the mother's putting the daughter through. Kanye has seen what path Kim went through. But see, dudes be like, hey, that's my girl. You know, our kids aren't going to do that. But how can you make a woman try and change who she is to try and do that in regards to the kids? Sometimes you got to be careful because it could be almost as worse. Because they felt allegedly, allegedly, they talk about them being, the girls being emped out. They have to post every week or every two weeks. They have to have a big storyline every month. Something that's, wow, ooh, they're, they're talked about. Then people are saying they're being, I could say that. They're saying, a lot of people are saying the mom groomed them to be this way. The mom is imping them. So what wishes? Kanye, it's a lot because you figure... He seemed extremely happy even with Shani Jones. And he seems extremely happy with Bianca. Not a lot of posts, keeping to himself, things that said he's not addressing nobody. He is minding his business. And then people talk about, oh, Kim might be trying to, you know, is she trying to talk to Pete? I think Pete's in a relationship with Chase. I don't I really haven't seen him, Pete, and Chase together lately. But then there was a little shade in regards to Pete wanting to get into 
Taylor Swift DMs. Taylor Swift is not thinking about no Pete. And then Pete's so gross, he talk about his size. He talk about his BDE. And then Kim's so sick and weird, she was talking about his BDE too. Come on, how old are we? This is not high school. Most men have them, okay? So weird. And then the mom saying weird comments to try and zing the media to, to, to talk about stuff. Because they, see, what you have to realize is several things are going on. Kanye been talked about Kim's being talked about and there's not a lot of great press a lot of it's like 60 to 70 percent not great press they're they're literally like dragging them it's sad but people are talking about they they need to take a break everybody needs a break from the K's and the J's and then you have Courtney saying should the K's and the J's retire so then you also have that Kylie's trying to date this guy every time I think of Kylie I think about the noose I think about her having the Astro part world party and then I think about Chloe talking about the K's and the K's and the only men that's accepted into the family. So what wishes? I think she might be having, and she will, she'll, she'll find somebody to post about, post be with. She'll find somebody. But mind you, she's allegedly looking for a guy, allegedly into, or that can help her in regards to her next business venture. She looks at guys as someone that boosts her career, stay relevant assist be able to be on camera be seen on camera you figure with the reggie bush it was of course going to football games being in the stands in regards to kanye being able to go to shows being able to go to grammys being able to go to ame awards it was she's always seeking somebody to boost the career and teach her or continue to keep her in the media period 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 and then like i did a video in regards to, she wanted to meet Reggie Bush, so she made that happen. She thought her and Kanye were going to get together, but Kanye ended up starting to date Amber Rose. And then she was like, hey, allegedly, all alleged, allegedly, she was like, hey, Kanye, I thought you were going to call me. And he fell into that trap. So men are probably cautious about what transpired. Even if she dates someone, I don't really think Kanye's going to really respond like he did in regards to Pete. Because Kanye's with Bianca. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He's just going to be concerned about whoever's around is cheering. Because, of course, she's raising them. And that's what the courts do. They give the mom pretty much 80 to 90% of the time. And then the dads are weekend dads. Or, you know, you have them once a week. I have them once a week. But the mom is mainly raising them. And morals are questioned. People are questioning Kim's morals. People are questioning Kim if she's grooming. People are questioning Kim if she's trying to let North grow up too fast. We're seeing it. Then, allegedly, they're saying Kim was in a Balenciaga outfit with your daughter. I, Y'all, people, focus on healthy, safe relationships. Be around people that's good to you. Be around people that's strong in mind, body, soul, and spirit. For the price of fame, I think it's chaos. I think it's drama. I think they're trying to stay relevant. I think they're using the media to sell items. I think they're using the media to press this narrative of things that's concerning. Things that's concerning. So stories are being planted about Kanye to distract away from. And then there's a story about David. Who knows what's really going on with that? Whether he really has a GoFundMe. Because if he do do a GoFundMe, they'll probably try and take that too. So what was this? Who knows if what's going on with David really happened? If he had an established company, come on. How can you have an established company, but now it's now yours? Everyone, be kind, be respectful. Have a great weekend.